All right. Hmm. I feel like these are uh, mostly lymphocytes, probably. They're round and dark nuclei, and they've got a little tiny rim of blue cytoplasm, and there seem like there are more lymphocytes than there should be from what we've seen on the previous ones. So when I see that, I would wonder about like maybe CLL, SLL. And you're saying that because there's a smudge cell here. Oh, is that, I actually, that, oh, okay. I didn't actually know that, but now that you say it, I do remember hearing, I just thought when I see an increased number of lymphocytes that look like small, normalish lymphocytes, I always think, oh, CLL, SLL. Plus it's really common, right? So right. this is a trap. Oh. I'm sorry, I trapped you on purpose. Um, because <laughs> not all smudge cells are CLL. On a test, you see small mature lymphocytes and smudge cells, you pick CLL, SLL, and move on. Um, I honestly have seen more smudge cells with viral illnesses. Oh. This is neither one of those two things. Oh, okay. So here's a higher power picture. This is a small lymphocyte. This chromatin is mature. It's got the thin rim of cytoplasm. But look at that blue compared to this blue. Different color for sure. This, this is a darker blue. There is a nucleolus here that's sort of faint, but you can see but yeah, it. it's like a darker color of the chromatin in the middle. Okay. And then you have sort of a roundish but slightly irregular nuclear contour. No owl rods. This is actually B-A-L-L. A-L-L. So, well, and that is before the 2000s. We still use B-A-L-L sort of colloquially. So that's but, acute lymphoblastic leukemia? Yeah, it's leukemia. B lymphoblastic leukemia slash lymphoma. Oh, okay. Is the technical now... Uh, classification. But it was the entity formerly known as, as ALL, ALL, right? Right. Okay. And it's so much easier to say it that way. I think it's going to be a long time before that name dies out because it's been around for so long. I don't right? think it ever will because it's less of a mouthful. And when you're telling patients and families what it is, you know, which one are they going to remember? Yes. 